What's going on, everybody? The Air Lord is back. Um, trying to figure out where this is. There we go. Like that. Uh, <laughs> it's been a while since I've done the webcam thing. Um, most of the time, I just have generic Walking Dead pictures as the overlay for my videos, but um, kind of wanted to make a different type of vlog today. Uh, just a general update. Uh, I'm sure most of you, for the people who are still kind of following my channel, I guess. Um, and I know I don't post a lot or haven't been lately. Um, and you know, there's, there's been various reasons for that. Obviously the current situation that everyone's going through has dictated a lot of, uh, a lot of the availability of, of, of just people being able to, you know, watch and participate and, I mean, there's more time to watch videos now than ever, I suppose, since a lot of people are still stuck inside, or if they're, you know, in school, they're doing virtual learning, or if they're at work, they're doing virtual work, work from home. Um, so, I guess, <laughs> I guess to give a full preface here, you know, the, the Walking Dead Season 10 finale comes back in a week, um... I will be doing a reaction to it just just so everybody knows. Um, you know, it's been it's just been a long time, and I've I've considered doing a couple of different vlogs for uh, you know covering the channel, um, covering new photos or new video clips or new things that come out about The Walking Dead. Um, I've seen like I've seen Fear the Walking Dead season six has been promoting heavily. Uh, all of the weird things going on with Morgan where he looks like he's got like the red eyes and he's like walking around like hobbling with a cane and then like there's the video where the walkers aren't really biting him and then <clears throat> kind of weird stuff going on there. Um, again, you guys know that I wasn't a big fan of the first half of season five of Fear. I didn't watch the second half. Um, I do know what happened to Morgan, um, but it looks like they're doing some weird stuff with him this upcoming season. Um... And then we got World Beyond, which I, I'm ex I'm excited for that. I mean, I think that's that's a chance at like a, a, a reset uh, because they don't have to rely on the lore or the characters from Fear the Walking Dead in the original show. They can kind of just do their thing, you know. Uh, it's gonna deal with the CRM group that has Rick captive. Whenever the hell we get answers to that with the movies that will resume filming in freaking I don't know when. Um, any news for the movies has just been, they're like, oh, well, because of the pandemic, we've had so much more time to write the script and really consolidate the story. And, and you know, it's going to be better. Like, trust me, like the, the so they're saying that the, the, the pandemic was a good thing for the script and developing the script out for the Rick Ryan movies, which, uh, you know, that's, that's an objective statement. You know, it's <laughs> for, for me, it, it's, it, they haven't gotten a start on filming or anything. And the more time that goes by, I just... I haven't seen any interviews or discussions with Andrew Lincoln recently. And I'm just kind of concerned where his head will be at for the movies. You know, will he care to do them? Will he not? I I don't know. I don't know. I don't really know if Andrew Lincoln is uh, exactly interested in continuing with the wacky world of The Walking Dead. He says that he is... But, you know, times have changed. I mean, you know, they, they announced, you know, that two years ago feels like 20 years ago. I mean, let's be honest. Uh, the, the world is so, so different right now. And who knows when film sets and movies are going to you know, open and stuff like that. <clears throat> I haven't tracked any of the filming for season 11. Um, I used to kind of dab around the spoiling dead fans and check out their community uh, but I know that a few months ago they changed ownership. Uh, the original owner left, and then they put it in the hands of some of the other members, and they opened like, they opened a new forum. But they said that they were still going to be tracking the Walking Dead's footage. But of course, there's a there's a the, 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 there's a time cap on that. Now that we know that the Walking Dead is ending with season eleven, but that's really not going to be until two years. Um, and that's why I didn't take that, like, the news wasn't a surprise to me. Also, the fact that we were getting, we're going to get a Daryl and Carol spinoff, it's kind of like the show's not really ending, and then there's also the movies, and the second season of World Beyond, and however fucking long Fear the Walking Dead goes, and then there's, 
individual character spin-offs that they want to do for some side characters, um, characters that have already died in the original show, uh, like Glenn and Abraham. I know some people were getting some predictions and stuff about that. Um, I mean, again, this was announced a couple of weeks ago when they said that the show was kind of coming to its conclusion. Um, but yeah, I mean, there's there's news and stuff coming out about it. I guess I guess just because of current circumstances with the pandemic, I haven't felt the, the, the normal excitement that I usually do for a Walking Dead season, if that makes sense. Um, because, I mean, again, we were supposed to get this episode back in freaking April. A lot has changed since April. Uh, the 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 it's it's just it's like an episode that's from another dimension or something. Like it's just it's hard to explain. Just the passage of time and how much is just changing in the world. You know, like I I want to be attached to what's going on in the finale, obviously. But you know, part of me is like, wow, like this episode was supposed to <laughs> we were supposed to get this episode months ago and now we're finally getting the conclusion to what happens in the the tower stuff with the the, the giant whisperer horde and B B beta and Negan and Daryl and like, how are they gonna make it out of that facility is my question. I'm also predicting that we're going to get something with the commonwealth uh we'll actually see them in person there was an interesting when they had like the trailer for the final season of the walking dead it wasn't really a trailer for the final season it was more of just like here's everything the walking dead's gone through and then the show is going to catch up to this point there was a brief snapshot of a commonwealth soldier actually like when the video kind of f was f fading out there's a brief snapshot of a Commonwealth soldier, not from the comics, but like an IRL one. Um, looked pretty authentic. I mean, it was a split, split second. I can see if I can uh, overlay that um, onto this video, perhaps. Um, maybe I'll do a separate discussion about that. I mean, that's definitely, I definitely want to try to get back into the content for the channel a little bit more. I know I've been MIA a little bit. Um, I just, I've been dealing with my circumstance, um, my IRL circumstances that have changed rapidly due to the pandemic. And that has kind of been my priority. And so for the channel, like, you know, I knew, I knew it was just going to be news, right? I knew that until October, we weren't going to be getting, we weren't going to be getting a lot of Walking Dead stuff. So I said to myself, okay, I'll, I'll save, I'll save the majority of my vlogs for when the show comes back, you know, in, in the past, I've done a lot of predictions and such and such like that. But, you know, uh, I, I, I watch another YouTuber who, uh, I think I've mentioned Trev's Chan too, was a little bit of the inspiration behind me doing some of this Walking Dead stuff in the first place. Um, and he does a solid job. He's still, you know, top notch. He hasn't slowed down, um, his production of his content. Uh, the pandemic hasn't really... Uh, throwing him out of whack too 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 much um so he's still got a steady stream and i thoroughly enjoy watching his stuff i would recommend it um i mean he does it in the same the same similar style that i do where it's just an off-the-cuff vlog but he's very knowledgeable about the walking dead universe and um i uh thoroughly enjoy watching his stuff um but yeah my i don't know his personal circumstances at all in terms of uh in terms of COVID, but, uh, for myself, you know, I've had to adjust a little bit and, um, hasn't allowed me as much time with the channel as I'd like. Um, and, um, it's crazy because if I could just blow my nose real quick on here, I know, unbelievably disgusting. Uh, <laughs> um, it's funny because my 10 year channel anniversary is coming up in a few months. Uh, December of this year is 10 years from when I started the channel and I'm not really sure what to do I'm not sure if I should do a celebration I'm not sure if I should I don't really know I don't really know that maybe that's something you guys can suggest uh, because again this channel as you guys know it started out with video game content uh, if you look at any of my old vlogs, it was playthroughs, walkthroughs, 
some convention footage, uh, just, and then, you know, when I went to college, it was content with my friends and different vlogs, and it, it just, it ran the gambit, you know, whatever games were coming out, whatever was going on at that time, I kind of just recorded it, recorded my experience playing the games, recorded my experience doing different stuff, and um, it was fun and entertaining. Um, so... Yeah, this, this channel is really, you know, half Walking Dead, half gaming content, and I'm not too sure what a 10-year vlog would look like. Um, so, if you guys have any suggestions about that, let me know. Um, but for now, I'm still hyped up, and we've got about a week until the finale comes back for The Walking Dead, and then we got World Beyond. Uh, World Beyond is basically gonna kind of take the place of the walking dead because we're not gonna get anything season 11 it's not happening and then there's those extra season 10 episodes that come back in like the spring or something i i'll have to check the timeline on that but um for now that's kind of kind of what we're looking at in terms of like content and such um so yeah um it's it's been it's been a roller coaster, I gotta say. I mean, I don't know what the situation's been for you guys, and I haven't really made, like, in a video kind of addressing any of this stuff one-on-one, -on -one, just the situation of the world. I've tried to make my videos as much of an escape from that as possible, but there's only so much escaping you can really do, and obviously, since I've been away for a bit, you know, people can, I guess, deduce why to a certain extent. Um, so... That's about the update that I got for you guys. Um, still excited for for the finale when it comes out. Um, kind of leave me your predictions and stuff. Maybe I'll make like one more kind of hyped up vlog in my usual video like image text overlay strategy that I usually do. Um, and uh, yeah, we guess we can go from there. And um, I'll probably. I won't do reactions to World Beyond. I'll probably just do individual reviews of the episodes. Um, I think that's fair. I want to give the series a fair shake. I did that for Fear the Walking Dead. I did re like reviews of the episodes for each one that came out. So I want to individually review World Beyond in the same manner. Um, again, something else that was supposed to come out in April, uh, but I mean, again, it's fun because it's a new series, and it's new characters, and I want to see if I give a shit about these characters or not, so, um, we'll see, we'll see if the production value is up, and if it, uh, if it's everything that, uh, it's been hyped up to be, and what information we get on the CRM, and how that relates to the movies, and all that fun plot stuff. So, um, yeah, without further ado, thank you guys for watching, and um, if you have any questions or comments about anything, just feel free to ask, and um, we'll continue to uh, go at our uh, our uh, normal pace here. I'll Now that it's getting towards this, again, this content, I'll try to be a little more consistent with uh, what I upload um, as we approach uh, the date, but um, yeah. That's all I got for you guys right now. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll uh, see you later.